neighbor is a person that lives close to us. But although our neighbors are just a stone throw away, sometimes we seem to overlook them when it comes to witnessing. Want to hear more? Join me in the next few minutes as we reflect on God's word and leverage the power of prayer. As Christians, you should know that it is important for us to love the people that surround us. The Bible says in Mark 12 verse 31, the second is this, you shall love your neighbor as yourself. There is no other greater commandment than these. We can demonstrate our love to our neighbors by giving a helping hand when they need us and by helping to be watchdogs in our communities. But the greatest demonstration of love to our neighbors is by sharing the love of Jesus to them. Let us not overlook the people that live the closest to us. You might be surprised at how much those Bible passages that you shared with them could brighten their whole week. Our greatest duty as Christians is to share the love of Jesus, no matter who it is. In the book Adventist Home, page 37, it says, then the work is to extend to their neighbors nigh and afar off. Those who have received light are to let the light shine forth in clear rays. Friends, believe it or not, one of the greatest gifts we have as human beings is the gift of influence. If you can use that influence to reach just one person, can you imagine that level of impact? You see, we might not get the opportunity to evangelize in far off countries like Europe or Asia, but we still can be in the mission fields with our neighbors. Both are just as important. Let us all pledge to be involved in neighborhood evangelism. Today, we're going to pray for a few things. Pray for your neighbors and your neighborhood. Pray that we can connect with them and establish relationships. Pray for all food pantry and community service outreach ministries of all churches worldwide. Pray for all who are engaged in online ministry through social media, videos, apps, and Bible study websites. Pray for marriages that are on the brink of divorce. Ask God to heal the relationships. Pray for forgiveness and Christ-like love to be awakened. Let us pray. Dear kind and compassionate Father, we give you thanks for this day. I ask that you heal everyone's life. I pray for the marriages I ask that you may help them to see your love growing through them. Help them to realize that you are God. I ask that you help everyone to be evangelists in their own space. I ask that you bless us and keep us. In your name I pray. Amen. Thanks for tuning in. If you have been blessed and encouraged by the 100 Day Prayer Series, let us know by sending a short video or message to 876-472-9483. You can tell us how the series has been impacting you. Your videos may be played on the final day. Before you go, remember to like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow us on all our social media pages at Shortwood SDA Church. Have a blessed day.